so Britt, <coughs> could you give us a few examples of some decisions companies might need to make um, if they want to prepare for CMMC on mm -hmm. their own? Sure. There are a few key areas uh, that a organization wants to think about. Um, one is where am I going to store my data? Where am I going to store CUI? Um, am I going to store that data or CUI on premise on my own servers? Or am I going to have a cloud based solution? Um, both of those have their unique requirements mm -hmm. uh, that you need to specify. So storage is one of those issues that you want to consider. Mm -hmm. um, another is, you know, how much of my network is going to be included? Is it my entire network? Um, is it a portion of my network, a subnet? Um, once again, that determines um, actually the amount of work required and mm -hmm. costs mm -hmm. are associated with that. Uh, so you want to be thinking about that, you know, how am I going to connect all the pieces and what are the requirements for that? Um, and, and then the other part that is really important is um, how am I going to monitor things and what am I going to monitor? You know, um, there are all the activities that take place on your network uh, need to be monitored. Who is trying to get in? Who is getting in? Mm -hmm. You know, what the, is their level or... Um, you know, how do I monitor all the logs that are being produced? Um, so once again, you need to think about that, uh, you know, the monitoring aspect of it. Um, and there's also that physical aspect of monitoring of your mm -hmm. facility. So uh, the requirement delves into a lot of different areas, mm -hmm. but monitoring is, is, a, is a key for that process. Thank you for watching this video to the end. This is part of a longer series on DFARS, NIST, and CMMC compliance produced by Core Business Solutions. Please subscribe to this channel, like this video with a thumbs up, and click the bell to get notified when we drop a new video. Also, we'd appreciate it if you would share this video with your colleagues who need to stay up to speed on DFARS, NIST, and CMMC. Thank you, and we'll see you again in the next video.